my dear student, I am Dr. Tapan Chandra Kulika and my channel Political Science Media TV is a channel on different aspects of political science. Here, I am going to make uh, going to analyze on the SR of public administration. Students, the UGC has introduced paper on public administration to the third and fourth semester regarding honors and in the regular course which is introduced in the fifth and sixth semesters. Uh, this video is an introduction regarding the national public administration. Major points to remember are mentioned. Some figures and facts are also outlined. Point to point methods is followed as it is an academic platform. So, references have been taken from different sources. We honestly acknowledge them all. Study materials are given as parcel one, so broad study is necessary. For further reading, a list of the same is provided in the last part of this video. Today, now we come to the main purpose. Regarding the nature of public administration, we have two standpoints integral view and managerial view. Integral view refers to the entire activities of an administration. It covers manual, clerical, technical and managerial activities. Integral view aims for an integrated administration by counting the work of all persons ranging from the lowest to the highest in the administration. As the White observes that public administration consists of all those operations having for their purpose the fulfillment of fulfillment or enforcement of public policy. And the second is managerial view. Managerial view studies the work of the persons engaged in managerial functions in an organization as constituting administration as the aid as the main task of management in an organization. Thinkers like Simon, Thompson, etc. are important spokesmen of this behavior. They observe that administration is also used in a mirror sense to refer to the patterns of behaviors common to many kinds of cooperative groups. Thus, the integral view covers the entire personnel of organization, but the managerial view covers those who know the managerial techniques. Therefore, we can say that the scope of integral view is wider, whereas the managerial view is narrower. In addition, it is seen that in public administration, things are described Theories are described, missiles are described, how the managers, the management personalities, functions, it is also described. So ultimately public admission is a descriptive type of subject. Then you can also see that it is a dynamic subject because in the senses of time and circumstances, new things, new methods, new techniques, new new patients come into existence and all these things are newly introduced in the uh, in the study of public administration where, uh, where if some things are not necessary or become unnecessary then can be abandoned therefore you can see that uh, public administration is a dynamic type of subject now next Public administration, where we are talking about, ultimately we are talking about certain activities. Activities of the officers, activities of the directions of the officers to uh, their subordinates. So ultimately some activities are concerned. When there is the presence of activities, ultimately it is a type of arts. At the same time also we can see that uh, what type of techniques are uh, techniques uh, better the efficiency of an organization or an uh, institution ultimately 
ultimately experimentation come into existence existence so ex experimentation of different types also present in public administration so where there is an experimentation ultimately there is the presence of science so we can see that public administration is a good mixture of arts and science to my students so if we combine all these things then the main uh, methods of our discussion will be number one managerial activities only activities in nature is considered supporter Simon Thompson number two integral all types of activities is considered supporter white descriptive describe the subject matter concerns relations with public etc dynamic changes according to time and circumstances art and science combination of art activities, activities and science presence of experiment so in these five major points we can we can uh, uh, we can uh, make all this discussion come under so now the next thing and very important thing is that what type of question may ask in the examinations so type of question is also very much important because of examination point of view now we're going to this uh, this, this important topic here some multiple choice objective type of questions are given number one nature of public administration can be understood from two standpoints two or false definitely it is true number two the equation view refers to the entire activities only activity both none of the above we in the discussion we know that integral view covers entire activities of an invitation so the A is correct then number three the managerial view refers to entire activities only executive both none of the above here we uh, we come to know that managerial view only considers the executive type of activity so B is correct question number four LD White supports the integral view of the nature of public admission. Yes, it is true. Then in number five, number five, two statements are given. Number one statement, the integral view covers the entire personnel of the organization. Number two statement, the managerial view covers those who know the managerial techniques. The number A, statement one is true. But two is false, no. Number two also is true. So here uh, B, uh, the statement one is false, but two is true, no. Number one statement also correct. Here uh, C option is uh, given, both are true, yes. Both are true statements. So the correct answer will be number C. Num question number six. Integral view is a wider, is wider in scope than that of managerial view. Yes, it is true. Number seven, man, one supporter of the managerial view of the nature of public administration. Student, you can find so many spokesmen of a managerial view. Here, uh, we mention the name of Simon. The number eight, which one of the following is not true regarding public administration? Public administration is descriptive in nature. Yes, it is descriptive. It is dynamic subject. Yes, it is dynamic. It is the combination of art and stuff. Yes, it is also correct. Then what is uh, written in number D option? Public administration is a branch of physical science. No, no. It is not a branch of physical science because in physical science there is the discussion of physics, chemistry, all these things. So it is. It is, a, uh, it is a branch of social science. So uh, the statement D is incorrect. So uh, the correct answer will be number D. Nine number question. Statement. Public administration has sense in changes of time and circumstances. Statement two. 
Public administration is the combination of art and science. Both statements are true. So where it is uh, mentioned? So here in number C we uh, we see that both are true. So this is the correct answer. So uh, C is correct. Then uh, we come to uh, the question number ten. Thinkers like Simon Thompson uh, are some. Uh, important spokesman of managerial team. Yes, it is a true statement. So, students, this type of question may ask in the examination. So, so please uh, practice it. And uh, in the books also, we can get some other question. So, when you practice uh, with this uh, type of questions, you can get uh, you can get knowledge and you can get more marks in the examination. Uh, for further readings, we mention some names of the book, important books. Uh, we we'll keep uh, here yeah, the links also. In the first, we make the link, uh, give the link of Buto Ocean, who is known as the father of public administration. So, uh, he, for the first time, mentioned uh, public administration in his article, The Study of Public Administration. We give the link here in the video. You can see and download it. Then uh, important books of Rumki Basu, Public Administration Concepts and Theories, published by Starling Publishers. Mohit Bhattacharya, another good book, New Horizons of Public Administration, published by Jawahar Publishers. Then Avasti and Maheshwari, Public Administration, published by Lakshmi Narayan, other books. There is another good link for the student of public admission. Here also you get uh, some uh, links of certain books of public administration. So the student, if you like this video, um, uh, it's important for you, then you subscribe and also call to your student to subscribe it. So thank you very much.